Hello there. Okay, I have a battle of the boxes. So I have Sephora Play, Boxy Charm, and the Ipsy Glam Bag. Do they still call it the Glam Bag? I don't know. Weird thing, I got two Sephora boxes this month for some reason. I haven't checked and seen if they charge me double or anything yet, but I kind of have a feeling why, because I've opened them already to see why did they send me two boxes. They were sent like three days apart from each other, and um, I think I figured out why. This is the first box that they sent, um, and it's just the typical, you know, regular play box. Inside this particular bag, it had four items in here. So it has this um, aerobian, I'm saying that completely wrong. I just made that up completely. It's herborian. I can read now. It's a bamboo cream frappe. Um, it's skin reviving freshing gel. It's not a moisturizer. I have to read up on this. I'm not sure. I'll read it. Um, and it also came with this, hmm, the Estee Edit flash photo gloss um, I'm not sure of the shade here I, I don't know how long these people are gonna be out there cutting the grass cutting trees or whatever it seems like they've been out there for hours so <laughs> so sorry for the background noise but it is what it is all right so this is a it just says flash photo gloss that's a tongue twister for me um, it looks like an opalescent liquid in here Obviously, it's a gloss. Oh, it's a goopy gloss. Oh, and it's very, very extremely sticky. So it's just like a clear gloss that is super sticky. Whoa. It says that it's an innovative high shine gloss with cool blue undertones that make teeth appear brighter. It's the ultimate must have for selfies. The cool factor, you can forgo the filter. This lip gloss comes from Estee Lauder's guest editor curated my hair is in my mouth. Um, a makeup line and skincare. Favorite trick to bright, brighten every smile with time. What? I can't read. Favorite trick for a bright smile every time we snap a photo. Okay, you swipe it over your bare, or bare lips or over lipstick. All right, are my teeth whiter? I don't know. Okay, let's move on. The next thing in this box is from Christoph, Christoph Robin. It is a regenerating mask with rare prickly pear seed oil. Sounds interesting. It smells almost like, what was that baby lotion back in the day that I can't pick? Uh, Johnson's baby lotion? Oh, no, no, baby magic. That's what it smells like. It smells like baby magic baby lotion next we have from smashbox this is i'm not sure what color this is it doesn't really say it just says a56 on it but it's a really beautiful color i want to read and see exactly what it says about this boy they're going to town outside wow <sighs> okay it says all the lip long day smashbox always on matte lipstick liquid matte lipstick um, it keeps going for eight hours with a water-resistant, non-feathering formula. Dab off any excess product and then outline the lips with the applicator. Use the large end to fill in the lip color and customize your look. Try layering different shades. Blah, 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 blah. All right, let's try this one out. It has like a little well in there to kind of hold the color. I like this color. This is very nice. Let's see how it goes with this. I'm sorry. I'm so distracted by the guys outside, people riding their bikes. I just can't today. Forgive me. <laughs> All right. So let's see how long my lips were kind of, I want to get stuck on my teeth. Um, let's see how long it takes to dry down because it's still, it's starting to dry down now, but it's a great, great color. Beautiful color. All right. So these were the four things in this first box from Sephora. Um, 
And then the second box was slightly different. No. Actually, it was more than slightly different. It's like completely different. The only thing that's the same is the Smashbox lipstick. All right. It's still drying down. It feels a little bit tacky. I'm hoping that tackiness goes away. I, I don't like that when there's like this tacky feeling when you have to talk and your lips want to stick together. <laughs> don't like that. It's creepy. All right. Okay, so the this one, yeah, it is completely different. Oh, yeah, you can see on the papers how they're different for the different boxes. They have one similar item and everything else is very, very different. Okay, they have a scent here from Tom Ford. This is the Orchid Soleil. I am such a fan of trying out new scents all over the place. I know people hate getting perfumes and stuff like that, but I'm assuming that this is just like an extra thing in the box and this is not included as a sample. Oh, this is, this reminds me of something else. This is very floral-like, very feminine. Um, I wonder what the notes are in this scent. Oh, obviously Orchid, because hello, the name is Orchid. Um, it says a summary take on the beloved Tom Ford Black Orchid. This warm fragrance is bright with hints of spice and exotic florals. Patchouli, that's the, the scent in the background that I kind of get out of there. Okay. And a little bit of vanilla. Yes. And then from Skin Ink, this is the Pure Revival Peel. Um, I like using peels. I, I don't use them that often just because I'm impatient. I'm a very impatient person. If I can't just put it on and wipe it off, I don't use it. I don't have time to be sitting there waiting for it five minutes. I gotta go. Got things to do. Okay, it says it exfoliates even as it repairs, maximizes absorption of nutrients from your skincare products, and primes your skin to create the perfect canvas for your makeup. So it just says that you apply this to your skin, leave it on for 10 seconds, and then massage in circular motions and rinse off with water. Use two to three times a week. This kind of um, peel, these are good ones. I don't like the ones that you have to leave on your face and then you have to mix it with something else and then it's just a mission to get it done. Um, this one's good. So um, I am excited to use this one and that's it, I'm excited. Next we have All-in-One Egg Mellow Cream. I am so not familiar with this, never heard of this. Too cool for school. It says you apply a, an, appropriate, an appropriate amount. It says you apply an appropriate amount on cleansed face, gently tapping and massaging collagen fibers, which stretches to increase skin's elasticity. Back to the paper. All right, I have to refer the paper. It says that it's a five-in-one multitasking cream made with egg extracts and collagen fiber. Works as a serum, priming moisturizer, eye cream, neck cream, and sleeping mask. Cool. I like that. Um, so the slightly stretchy texture of this cream makes it ideal for gently tapping into your skin. Use it in the morning or evening. Just be sure to cleanse first. I'm very curious about this texture. It keeps talking about this texture. So it's a little weird. It's, it's, it looks a little bit weird, but ultimately it feels the same like almost anything else. Might be a little bit more consistency, like you can kind of feel it a little bit more, but okay. Next is from Verb Leave in Mist. It's a detangling, defrizzing, and conditioning um, leave in mist. Just says that it's formulated to moisturize, detangle, and smooth. This conditioning mist also helps to protect hair from heat styling. Okay. Very cool. A really nice box from Sephora. And then we have from Nude Sticks. This is an intense matte lip and cheek pencil. Um, and this is in the color Bell. This is really nice. I apologize. The sun is kind of changing and doing its own thing. Um, nice color. It's very similar to the lipstick that's in here. Very nice color. So the bottom row here is one box and then the top stuff here is another box. So weird that I got two boxes, but you know, whatever. They were different boxes, completely different. The lip color, let's check out. Let's see. Um, it's not 100% transfer proof, but it barely, barely came off on my hand. like. Really, I think it'll be really great a long wear lipstick. It's comfortable. 
It doesn't feel completely set. It does have that little tiny, tiny bit of a tack to it. Mm. Yeah, if you were to put your lips together. But, you know, it's okay. Very lightly. All right, let's move on to BoxyCharm. BoxyCharm is, they're all $10 a month. Um, whoa, it's a huge card in here. Take a breather and slow way down, it says. That's what I need to do. All right, this is the box this month. Um, I think I, I missed out on picking out what I really wanted to get because I was a slow poke, but okay. All right, so we have from Parlor. I'm gonna take this out first since you get the shampoo and the conditioner, which is, I'm assuming, yeah, shampoo and conditioner. I've used their products before. I do like their products. Is this the one that smells very masculine? Oh no, this one does not smell masculine at all. I had to take off the little seal on there, but it's um, it's a very nice scent. It's not one of those, the masculine one. I forget which one that is. That one, I don't like the scent, but it works amazingly well. But anyway, so this is the parlor shampoo conditioner. At least it's a larger size. The conditioner is, you know, whatever. Um, and then a little tiny scent from Escada. This is Joyful. Oh, this doesn't have a little sprayer on it. I don't want to open it because it's going to be a big mess because I'm a messy person. Another cleansing milk. I got a cleansing milk in uh, my boxy charm. No, it, yeah, in my box, in my glossy box. I got a cleansing milk. So this is from Juice Beauty. This is another cleansing milk. Um, it says it deeply cleanses and removes makeup. So that's nice. I'll use this on my little face brush thingamajiggy that I got. Uh, I forget what you call it. And then from Tati, L-O-C, Love Tati. This is the, what shade is this? Smoke screen. It's the one and done stick. So this is the one for your eyes because it's silver. I doubt that you would put silver on your lips. And that's very nice on the eyes. Um, and lastly, oh, I did choose this actually because the box was gone and I think the box was really good and I think I chose the sample or something like that. Anyway, this is the resurfacing mask for Insta Glow from Tata Harper. So I've heard that her items are really, really good. Um, I've never used anything from her, her line, so I am excited to try it out. That is a weird, it's like a jelly. This is the strangest thing. What is this? Apply a thick layer onto cle cleanse the face, leave on for 20 to 30 minutes, and then rinse. Hmm, interesting. I think this is supposed to be like a, um, like a, what's that called? A skin uh, peel? Like a skin peel or something like that? Maybe like the, uh, what is that one? The skin ink one? I'm not sure. All right, so the birch box, it's an okay box. Um, it's not my favorite. Last month they really blew me away. This month is, it's kind of like, eh, it's okay. It's not bad, but it's, it's just okay. I like the, um, the one and done stick and I'm interested about this Tata Harper resurfacing mask thingy, whatever it is. So that's that. Last thing we have in here is from Ipsy. Oh boy, they actually sealed it up pretty good this time. Usually when you get your Ipsy bag, it's like everything is falling out of there. I should put something in here as an extra that I purchased. The card, ta-da. Okay, it says Ipsy Black Magic on it and there's never anything on here. Um, this is what I got. I got from Bare Minerals. This is the Gen Nude Matte Liquid Lip Color. Since I have this thing on and it's not coming off, I won't be able to try it out. But I'll put it on with everything else that I've tried. Okay. It's a really nice um, let's see, container. It's oh, yeah. like a frosted glass. It's really pretty. So I think it was 500 points, I want to say. five or 700 points, Ipsy points. I just noticed as I'm looking at this um, container, that it's kind of shiny towards the bottom and then it goes matte on the way up and that's pretty cool it's just a slight difference i didn't notice it until i looked really closely at it um so we'll see how this dries down we'll try it out and see okay this is the bag it's very halloween-ish it's got little ghosts and goblins and witches and ouija boards and lipsticks and bats and what all that all that stuff in there it looks white on here but it's not it's pink oh the little thingy here is like a little ghost that says Ipsy something. Oh, Ipsy. First thing in here. This is a concealer pencil. 
and it says medium four. So this is from Nude Sticks, and I did get this from the Sephora Play Box. That's this lip color right here. Um, so, but this is a concealer stick. So let's see, this is the other Nude Stick right here. So this is the concealer. Okay, and we have a brush in here. This is from Lottie, Lottie London. This is a cool brush. It's just a flat, like you can kind of like uh, pack a whole bunch of color on. Or you can use it as a concealer, I guess, if you wanted to, to blend out concealer. Right. Next in here is, oh, there's like three more things in here. Got a lot of stuff. Uh, from Noya. I do like Noya. I've gotten Noya lip colors in the past and I think it's only lip colors. Oh, this is a cool little package. Um, yes, I've gotten a lip gloss and then lipsticks and this is cool because it has um, like a rainbow of colors in the back so you can see the different shades. Um, this one here is in Smoke. Where's Smoke on here? Smoke, 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 Smoke. Smoke is this one right here. Boy, this is the month for lip colors, I'm telling you. So this one just says here, so it's just a natural lipstick. It doesn't say that it's long lasting or anything like that. It's just um, uh, natural, no sulfate, no parabens, and no phthalates. I think that's how you say it. Um, cool. And this one is from Sally's Box. It's an aqua moist gel cream, another gel cream kind of a thing. Um, oh, this smells awesome. It smells like perfume. If you don't like perfumey scents, on your face you might not like this and who knows I might not like this on my face either it smells amazing but to have it on your face is another thing but it looks pretty cool this looks really nice I can only assume that this is um, maybe some Korean skincare because the back side has um, different type of writing on the back um, that I, I can't read at all so and the last thing in here is from Cabana Boy from the balm this is a blush they make such cute little packaging, no matter. I mean, really, how are you going to get a brush into that little thing? But whatever, it's cute, isn't it? It says, so many men, so little time. So these are all my boxes and bags and all that stuff. Um, this month, I don't know, it's a toss-up between the Sephora Play Box and the Ipsy Box, or bag, whatever you want to call it. So, um, and I'm not saying that because Sephora Play gave me two boxes, but um, all in all, I think they had great items in the Sephora play box, but um, the Ipsy was really nice as well. So let me know what you guys think. What did you guys get? I know this was quite long, but there was a lot of boxes to go through. So um, thank you guys so very much for watching. I do have links down below in the description box if you wanted to join. I get points if you join under my link, um, and that goes with everybody else. Um, so if you join with any other link anywhere, you'll be giving somebody points. So give me some points. I don't know. I'm just saying. Um, Sephora doesn't have any referrals, so you can look up SephoraPlay.com. I believe that's what it is. And, uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and I will see you again in another video. Bye.